Explainer videos are one of the most effective ways to explain a complex idea and at the same time making it interesting to watch. And that is the reason why you can see many top brands are using explainer videos to explain their products or services to their customers or in a pitch or a business meeting to explain their business idea. And if you are an animator or a motion designer, knowing how to create explainer videos will instantly make you on high demand. But making an explainer video is a tedious process, especially if you don't know the right tools, the techniques, or use the right process. And that's the whole purpose of this explainer animation course, which will be freely available on YouTube. So throughout this course, we will learn the right techniques, the process, and the tools, and how to use it by creating this cooking explainer animation project from start to the end. And you can get all the files, illustrations, and assets that we will be using throughout this course from our website link in the description and also in the pinned comment. So this is an introductory lesson where I'm going to give you an overview of what exactly we're going to cover throughout this course. And throughout this course, I'm going to explain each and everything in details so that if you are new to After Effects, you don't have to worry. You can easily follow along. But before moving forward, hit the like button and comment down below. That motivates me to create more free courses and tutorials like this. So in lesson 1, we will learn the designing process in Adobe Illustrator. So in this lesson, we will learn the correct way to design characters and other elements in uh, Adobe Illustrator so that you can later on rig it and animate it in After Effects. In lesson 2, we will learn how to animate hands and in this lesson, we will learn some interesting techniques to rig and animate fingers uh, like this. In lesson 3, we will learn how to animate this egg cracking animation. And in this lesson, we will learn some interesting technique to how to make something look fluidy and what are the exact effects that we need to use and what are the correct settings for that. And you can use these techniques in lots of other places to animate smokes and other effects like that. And in lesson 4, we will learn how to rig face of a character so that you can animate the face in any direction in 2.5D using just a single controller. Then in lesson 5, we will learn how to rig full body of the character using Tweak Angular so that you can easily move the arms, the limbs and the body and the head, all, all of them connected together and you can easily animate the character using just few controllers. And then in lesson 6, we are going to use the character rig that we are going to do in lesson 4 and lesson 5 and animate a character animation like this. And in this lesson, we are going to learn some interesting and most important techniques while animating characters. In lesson 7, we will learn how to animate fire like this. And in the final lesson, we will learn how to transition using match cuts. So match cuts are very effective way to transition between scenes, yet if you don't implement it correctly, it can ruin your animation. So in this lesson, we will learn the correct way to transition between scenes uh, using match cuts so that the whole transition and the frames before and the frames after, everything looks intact and feels like it's part of the same video. So for character rigging and animation, we will use Tweak Angela. If you don't know what Tweak Angela is, it's a free comprehensive character rigging and animation plugin which you can use to rig and animate characters in whatever way you want. So you can download it for free from their official website and uh, I will be providing the link of their website in the description so you can get it from there. And I also have a comprehensive character rigging course using Tweak Angela in my YouTube channel. So if you want to learn how to rig characters uh, in full details, then I would highly recommend you to check that out. So I will be providing the link of the course in the description. So go check it out. And that is it for this video. And also do like this video and do let me know in the comment section. I mean, anything. If you have any suggestion, do let me know because your likes and comments really motivates me to continue creating more free courses and tutorials like this. So that is it. I will see you in the next one. Until then, goodbye.